So, hello guys, um, in the last video we were, we are going, we are going to mesh everything. Let me switch to a three-dimensional view. I think it will be better. Okay. I'm going to select object number one and eight, which is the base and top of, uh, base and top object, the foundation. And this top object okay now with this object selected I'm going to set the matching options for those I could go to analysis menu calculation model matching options but I prefer to come here option of my finite element mesh select this meshing options okay these are the meshing options related to the objects that you have selected if you have none object selected, it will be applied to all of the objects. So I'm going to make it the delineate. It is the most uh, flexible one. I'm going to choose it. I'm also setting the element size to one. I'm going to choose OK. Now I'm going to choose the columns, which will be two, two, seven. In the selection, over here, you may choose one, give it a space, choose eight, and you will select the object one and object eight. If you select two, two, seven, you will pick object number two, three, four, to seven all the columns if I pick one to wait I would select everything okay enter sorry one two two seven and press enter okay I select that and now I'm going to the options for this object and I'm going to pick the DLNA option once again mesh generation will be automatic and the division points I want two okay division one I want two. Okay, now let's generate the finite element mesh. I'm going to analysis generation of computation model. Robot is generation the model. I'm going to turn off the node numbering and you may see our finite element mesh over here okay now let's assign some uh, properties i'm going to geometry menu properties solid properties and i'm going to pick a concrete material okay for all these solid elements select concrete right all I press enter okay there you go if the material is not available on the available material list over here the user should press the icon definition of new solid properties and add concrete to the list of materials over here okay close that close this the next video we will apply some loads and move on to finish the exercise okay so thank you very much